This is Wild Horizons Elephant Sanctuary. Whoa, we got someone stealing. <laughs> So we are in Zimbabwe. Zimbabwe is a country in Africa. I'm looking forward to feeding the elephants because apparently one of the elephants sucks it up off your hand. We're going to the Wild Horizon Sanctuary, where they rehabilitate injured elephants so they can go back into the wild. Before we can start our episode, we have to make a disclaimer. The sanctuary wanted us to tell you that our interactions with the elephants were not typical. <laughs> and not all guests get to get as close and hands-on with the elephants as we did. Ready to go? Yes. Okay, so now we're headed out into the bush to get as close to the elephants as possible. And then we have a walk. We have to walk, walk, walk. So before we meet the elephants, we have to find them. And that's not as easy as you think. Before we spotted the elephants, we found ourselves in a giraffic jam. There's a family of giraffe right in front of us. Check out the way they move, it's so weird. Giraffes can run up to 35 miles an hour, but these giraffes huh? are in no hurry. Sorry giraffes, but we're here to see elephants. The elephants we are looking for are considered semi-wild. They live and roam freely, but are cared for day and night by the sanctuary team, who are prepping them for release into the wild. Okay, we've spotted the elephants. They're just under those trees. Warning. Do not try this at home. We are approaching elephants with trained professionals. I can't believe it. We're about to meet elephants. Just like in the wild, these elephants live in social groups called herds. There's a baby elephant. There's this tiny little baby that you see. The baby's name is Mangaliso, which means the prize. She's adorable and feisty. <laughs> a large female scratches herself on a tree and then starts eating right beside us. We are so close. We see the lines on her skin and the size of her feet. We approach slowly and touch gently. This is nothing short of a dream come true. But she's got places to go and we are in her way. She'll eat 300 pounds of food today, so she has to keep moving. If the elephant wants to go somewhere, get out of its way. They're all females except for the big guy at the back. His name is Jumbo. Jumbo is so big. He weighs about the same as three cars. I approach as calmly as I can. Whoa, my heart is pounding. He doesn't mind my touch. And they encourage me to go in for a hug. Oh my goodness! This is actually happening! Soon, Archer was in there, and so was Wilder. Along with being gentle, Jumbo was curious. <laughs> now, we're gonna walk with elephants. Soon, we were on the move making our way to the feeding area. So we're following the matriarch and the rest of the herd is following us. The elephants snack along the way. The elephant just picked up an entire small tree and is starting to eat it. And the little one breaks formation to explore. They're all in a line behind us. This is so incredible. Mom even got kissed by one. Elephant tattoo. Easy. 
Whoa, these guys are ready for food. They're all lined up and they're hungry. This is one of the two ways of how you feed an elephant. Trunk up. Oh yeah, we've got this. This is so fun. The other way to feed an elephant is putting the food in its trunk. It then shoots the food from its trunk into its mouth. And wants more. I love my job. my hand. By the end of the feeding, we even had some looking for seconds. Oh, we got someone stealing. <laughs> so we just got to feed and meet some wild elephants. Now we're going to paint orphan elephants. If you want to see more of our elephant encounters, be sure to subscribe. Because in our next episode, oh my God. we're doing art with elephants. That's good, Archer. Now go outside and play.